Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's work on the problem twenty one in chapter four. In this one, uh, it become a little bit different. In this one, we give you the force and the mass, and then ask you to determine the motion of this object. Let's say for the object, and we first do the force analysis. There must be gravity pointing down. And then the force act on the rocket by the gas F T. Do you agree? Yes. Then the first question ask you the acceleration. So there we can see the F T is given. The mass is given. Can you find acceleration? Sure. We can consider the Newton's second law. This F T minus m g equals the m a. This one. In this one, it's very easy for us to get the acceleration for this uh, uh, rocket. The next one, we say, tell you, uh, ask you to find its velocity after a certain time, eight seconds, and then also ask you to find the time when it uh, and tell you the displacement. So in this one, it's become easy. This is Newton's second law, but B and C are the chapter two. The motion of the object in one direction. Do you agree? So, this one to find the velocity after a certain time, we use this motion equation: initial velocity plus acceleration times t. This initial velocity is zero, so then we are done. The next one asks you to find the time t for a certain displacement. So you can see this displacement is given. Initial velocity is zero. Acceleration is given, and then it's easy for us to get the time taking. Thank you.